Hello and welcome to the gamers. Today we will be discussing Ultra Street Fighter 4. Yeah, the new update coming in 2014. Yeah. It's gonna be absolutely mental. That, that's why we're so confused. It's gonna be such a mental game because of what they've mentioned mostly about is the fact that the top tiers aren't gonna get nerfed. No. Everyone else is gonna get buffed. That's what that's what they're saying. They're saying everyone, everyone's getting buffs. Buffs to how, make it level, but it's how many buffs are you gonna get, and what's gonna get buffed? Yeah. So that is the discussion of today's video. We're gonna be talking about buffs, nerfs, top eights. What we think with the next top eight? What we want to say? What we think we'll say? Yes. What we want our characters to get? What we think our characters might need to be taken away? Yeah. We're fair here. Yeah. Kind of. Ish. I right, think we start off with our uh, Rose. Okay. So Simon, when he when he does play Street Fighter Four, he's the character that I know best. Yeah. Yeah, it's one that I can at least compete with. Um, right, so let's do buffs first. I mean, I think uh, quite, quite, a few rose play, quite, quite a few Rose players say this. She needs a few more focus uh, FADC options, basically. Can you already, um, can you FADC after the drill or not? No. No, so yeah, I, I, I think that's fair enough. Um, and the other ones, and these, and these are more personal, really, for me. Um, more invincibility on the air grab that she's got, because it's one of her probably least used moods for the fact on, that... On um, all versions or just EX? Or like now that I had thought about really, yeah. Because so, that's a bit, that's a bit too complicated. But I mean, what I'm talking about with invincibility is the fact that most jumping moves will take her out of it. Yeah, it has to be an empty jump. Yeah, which means that you're taking more 50/50 than they are. Or you've got to react mega quick. It, it, it didn't. I mean, start upon the move is, is is fantastic. I mean, no doubt about that. But just a few more frames of invincibility and that will be fine. It'd be, it'd be usable. Yeah. And lastly, for buff, I think she needs is her standing fist, one where she flicks out her. Um, Scarf. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, oh, they're like kind of. Just, just, just make it a bit quicker. Just, I mean, just for a poke. I mean, I know we obviously most standing faces aren't pokes anyway, but just, just make it a bit quicker. Because in a minute, you can jump over it so easily, and you've got basically about ten hours to punish it. Uh, really. And so nerves, nerves. What I think she's going to get um, less damage on a crouching face. Now the reason I say that is because it's so easy to hit, it will go through any jumping move. It's like, it's like Sakura's, isn't it? And those two crouching faces are amazing. So keep the um, frames on it the way they are, just just dumb down the damage, because you, you, you will get two or three around. Yeah. So at least do a bit less damage, and the other one is make her slide more punishable. Yes. Slightly. 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 I mean, just make it a bit more neutral for both yeah. characters. It characters. should be used the way she kind of does it, but you can't just kind of... They can just do it out willy nilly, well, whatever they want. <laughs> slide, a slide crouch and medium punch. Yeah. And you'll get so many counters yeah. on, on that. Uh, so just make, the, just make the slide a bit more neutral for both characters. Yeah. And okay. that's, and for me, I mean, obviously we're going into much more depth, obviously, but we'd be here for years. Yeah. So that's why I think Rose slash needs slash deserves. Okay, so if you've watched um, Super Street Fighter 4, Sweet or Salty, you know the main is Guile. Yeah, so we're never going to hear oh, what Guile Even means. though he's not much of a good, good main, I'm not brilliant with him, but. Um, okay, the Ultra One, I only ever use Ultra One. Um, uh, faster start up and make it a true anti air. The amount of times you see someone jumping, they do a move, and I. And, the, and they're not even purposefully trying to crush you up, they're actually coming down at you. Yeah. yeah. And I will do the move, and then before you know it, they've actually landed their own block. Oh no, you'll do, no, you'll do one hit. Oh no, yeah, there's, yeah, there's that. What Aiden's saying is that they'll just land in block and, yeah. you'll, and, they'll, and they'll block. Even though they're just on a move and you see it, uh, but because the start of it's so slow. Mm. Um, I was going to mention with Ultra One that sometimes they'll get hit once and then they'll pop over the other side of it, yeah. which isn't. You know, I mean that. I mean that Ultra hits almost like 180, and yet they'll just pop out of it. So it yeah, went away too easy. And then what I thought would be fair is if you make it a true anti-air and have a good start and good invincibility, you have the damage. Yeah, I'm happy we'll for you to take the damage. That. Yeah, yeah, we'll take that. Yeah. yeah. It, um, okay. After a focus attack on a flash kick, apart from Sonic Hurricane, yeah, you should course. be able to combo with something else. Just a boom. Yeah, or standing fierce. Just just you something. Know, I think flash, standing fierce would be like a mid combo. Yeah. Every other character can pretty much combo. And you are a... using a bar. Yeah. Well, you're using more than a bar. Exactly, so. Two, two bars to focus attack it. The amount of times that I hit someone, and I focus attack it, and I just have to stand there. Yeah, exactly. Or no, no it's not because you dash out of it. Yeah, and then you just. Like, just can't do like Gal's just stood there thinking, well, then what do I do now? What, what I love is to be able to do air go after it. But I'm not going to say, I think that now, should he should now, have that. If that was a super jump one, yeah. which would then take skill and execution, then just give it him. Okay, and after the rolling so bad, so his back and medium kick. Which Dominion like, is talking about quite a lot with Gal, yeah. isn't he? Yeah. You should be able to combo boom after that, because to me, against characters like Yun Yang and Rufus, 
they get hit a lot by the Rolling Stone Bat, but because it does such little damage, and it doesn't do any kind of block stun, they just jump again straight away. So yeah. even though it's hit them, and I'm thinking if you can do Rolling Stone Bat, Sonic Boom combo, and then do like a Fierce afterwards, it doesn't have to, it doesn't have to all combo, but the Fierce can actually keep them at bay, and it's keeping that distance. Yeah. Anything like that. Okay, yeah, and so obviously the nerf would be the, uh, the ultra one. Then, um, do you want to go into Vega? Yeah, let's, let's, get, let's get through it. Vega, give him a true wake up. His wake ups are a bit shocking. Yeah, he's taken we'll, out of a lot. So, well, at the minute, I mean, with the tears, I mean, obviously people's tears differ, but Vega is yeah. definitely bottom tier. So, he, he, he does need a bit to compete with the tops. Makes certain links slightly easier, just slightly easier. So, compared to like Ryu, where crouching medium to crouching medium is, is, so it, it, it isn't even a link, no. it's, it's just a chain. And just like the uh, solar plexus to whatever after that. Yeah. Um, invincibility at start of Ultra 1. The amount, the amount of times you've input Ultra and then it pop up at the bottom yeah. with, with with a name <laughs> and then sweet, nothing will come what out. What sweet or salty. You'll okay. see it. And then the nerfs, um, I've got like two. Reduce either the range or the speed of his overhead. Yeah, the, the little the little hop over kick. Yeah. And um, on the rolling clip crystal flash. Just like we said about um, Rose's slide. Yeah. Just make it slightly punishable. Just not so effective at just constantly being able to do it. But well, it's the fact, isn't it? I mean, he can just do that, crouching light, that, crouching light. Yeah. And it's the fact that, again, just make it a bit more neutral for, for both characters. Exactly. Okay, who's who's next? They're, they're like kind of the characters that we play, so they're the, going to be the most in-depth we go with. So now we kind of talk to them and we thought, right, right, so who are the six who we think could be the most... Like, the, so we, we picked two who are definitely going to get buffs. Yeah. We then picked two who we think are going to be interesting because of who they are and their past. And then, and then we picked two that we think are going to get overhauls. Yeah. So the first two, Ryo and Akuma, as if, as if we needed uh, any more introduction. And what we've got for them is we think, um... Okay, Ryu, his Metsu Shoryuken Ultra 2 needs to be just more viable. Yeah. You don't see... It's kind of like Gaia's Ultra 1. It's just pure damage, but you need someone to really, really screw Mess up. Mess up, yeah. To be able to use it. Yeah. It should just be able to become... A, like, I, because Air Tatsu is quite hard to hit in this game, not the cross-up yeah. air tatsu. No. But like an air-to-air -air air tatsu. I think he, maybe if you hit them at the peak of the jump, you should be able to come all the way down and get the full animation. Yeah. I mean, that's, so the damage will be scaled, but at least yes. you would actually be able to use it. Yeah. Um, yeah. And we've thought, really, there would be no nerves for Ryu. Not particularly. If no. there is, there'll be like one frame of the light punch. You know, it's it's, 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 it's yeah. going to be that He small. won't have any, to me, he won't have any key nerfs. They'll just be little tiny things that make slight matchups slightly different but it won't really drop him at all. No. We think I mean remember, we've only done one one nerf and one buff for each of these characters yes, but, yeah. but we think Ryu's obviously gonna get quite probably quite a few more buffs than okay. nerfs. I'll let um Simon deal with Akuma because as you know from third strike and four just Akuma to me he's so, he gets away with murder in every single game. He's he good in every single Street Fighter game he's ever been in. And we think because he's top tier in this and they said that they're not going to buff top tiers. We're not sure what's going to happen with characters like Kami, Akuma, Seth, Rufus, or all these kind of things. And my point for Sam was, even if he didn't get buffed, he'd still be a top He's character. still fine. Oh yeah, he's still, he's still top. It's just whether certain matchups may change. But anyway, yeah. um, so we've seen really no foreseeable buffs because of the fact... Yeah, we, we can't see any buffs that he potentially should need. Because every single move of his is, is already godlike. Yeah. So yeah, um, um, and then we th thought what we think could be a potential nerf because Abuki had a nerf that it was commented on event hubs for all Street Fighter 4. She's definitely having less vortex. Yeah. So to me, and we think that makes sense. Akuma should either have less damage on his vortex or the way his I mean, vortex I works. mean, we're not talking massive because we know his no, vitality yeah, yeah. Is, is, I'm not, is lower. I'm not saying he should be absolutely ripped to pieces. He's just it's just a, it's just a tiny bit. Yeah. Take a bit off here and there, make certain things more punishable, and there you go, he's going to be Yeah, normal. so because then he'd be able to, then you'd have Dan's actually competing with Akuma. Yeah. Or then you would have, you know, other lower tier characters, Guile, there you go, Bison, they would actually be competing regularly with the top Akumas. All right, then after that, then we've sort of got the two who we think... Oh, yeah. Yeah, so the first one who we think is going to be top, somewhere towards the top, we're, we're not going to tell you where, but we think the character's going to be yeah, towards the top. Yeah. Um, she's, she has been buffed in every single version, very much like Gukan, but we haven't chosen him, no, because we think this character, Jory, is going to be. She's like verging on broken. She's like the hidden. She's like the hidden like character of one who just constantly gets buffs, but no one really goes to her. Yeah. We think. Oh, and we, that was a bit. 
piece of news was an infiltration he'd been practicing with Jory constantly. Before I mean, there's, he, though. There's the biggest thing you need. Yeah. But anyway, so yeah, so Jory, we think she's probably going to get damage, more damage, yeah. and FADC, I, I, more I, I FADC. I can see it now. I don't, think you can, I don't think you can do it, but I can see it now. Pinwheel, FADC, pinwheel. Yeah, and it's not even that hard. It's just Tatsu. Yeah. FADC Tatsu. I mean, it's already top points that move anyway, pretty much. Exactly. I mean, we think a dive kick will be less punishable. Um, she's already got four, three booms. Low, medium, high. Yeah, that's really and, she, and she can charge two. I could see her verging on being broken. Yeah. And Ultra 1 is going to get buffs. And then, um, okay, so we think the only nerfs that we can see that she'll, she'll probably get, not that we think she should get, but the ones that... I, we think so. It's, Possible. Um, frame nerfs, just certain moves just not being quite... Just so. slightly changed. Because yeah. we, we think her special will be made better, maybe her normals just made a bit less better. But we'll have to see. And then, then this is one of the new characters. Oh, Hugo. Hugo. Because this is who Simon plays in uh, Third Strikes. It's going to be interesting to see how this plays. We think he's going to take the crown of, from T-Hawk of being the highest health character in the game. Yeah, because he has been in every game he's in. Yeah. Yeah, we won't go into the QD details. Yeah, because that's the taunt and stuff. Um, but yeah, so we think the buffs that he'll get compared to Cross Tekken, because obviously he's, his sprites and everything, his animation come from Cross Tekken. So we'll start as if he's never been on the game. Okay. So we think he'll have the highest damage output or the highest vitality. Yeah. But his vitality is still going to be ridiculous. It's still going to be kind of either T Hawks or very, very close. Yeah. Like certain people are going to really struggle to kill him. Oh, like, yeah. Just because the match Gar hits. Guile's going to take forever to kill him. I mean, I could see Hugo just piling out the damage. I mean, I, I could see, I, I, you, know, you know, you know, big medium punch slap. I could see that being like 120 damage. I, easy. I, I'll tell you right now. I won't go on topic too much, but I can see it now that Gal would just get crossed up by the cra the body press, body, body and it would take my flash kick clean. Oh yeah. Ready and freed. <laughs> if he's real low down, yeah. Um, and then we thought. Perhaps the nerf he might get is that he will be without doubt the slowest slow. character. And no. his walk speed and his wake up are going to be. So, so slow. And his uh, focus, uh, focus uh, attack cancel ability will be done. One Literally to zero. Like you can't. Like I bet you can say one will be clap to maybe another clap. Yeah. That might that might literally be it. But I mean, the slow thing is going to make a massive difference because vortex characters are going to find him so easy to to uh, cross up, mix up. Unblockables because of the fact that you're gonna wake up so slow. We said that walk so slow. We said that, but look at Geef, like you know how like when I was doing the crouching jabs, mashing out. But no, 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 I'm talking about more like, more like a book, he's like kunai and you oh, know, okay, yeah, you yeah. Know, stuff like that. Kind of, he'll, he'll find that impossible. I think. Yeah. But with so much health and so much damage, we'll have, yeah. have to see. Him. Okay, have we got right, now we've got the overhaul character, the character that we think need an overhaul really. Yeah. First one, Bison. 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 Uh, more damage. And the link needs to be, this time we said about Vegas, slightly easier. Make him like the other characters. Yeah, like, he doesn't really get much for his links. No. He doesn't know, he didn't, there's, or damage, his damage. His damage really is shocking. Yeah, like, even to kill a normal health character, you've got to get seven, to, seven his, combos ish. His damage output has changed so much. Per game, like well, he, he got nerfed shockingly, didn't he? Yeah, like his super, damage in super, he was, in super, him, Gal, and Honda were like really good. That to me, they were like as good as what they, they should have been. Yeah, and then like they, on like Ryu's level, it, it kind of yeah, paid. but then they've just been like oh, no. they got dropped lower and lower. So we think he needs more damage, and his links just need to be a bit easier. Obviously, uh, but we said he needs a huge like, everything needs overhauling. Yeah, and then one of the key nerfs that we think he should get in exchange for that is. We're not going to totally take it away because this is a game plan. The yeah. light scissors just, like we said, just slightly... A funny. frame. Yeah, just a, a frame less recovery on it so he can't mix you up again afterwards. Yeah, and do like no. a light hit scissors. Well, obviously he can mix you up, but just make it a bit less... Yeah. I mean, it's, it's just like, I mean, if, if Vega wanted to, I mean, if Vega, if Vega went up against someone who doesn't have a good wake up, light crystal, light crystal, light crystal. Yeah. Okay. And he'll get candidates from it. And then, we, believe it or not, we did... Right, this before we it's went just on been, event hubs. Yeah, we just went to event hubs like 20 minutes ago. So after we wrote this, we put like Cody should have um, you know major buffs, and then we, you said that he's been announced. You to have a major overhaul, major overhaul. So 
So yes, I mean, I mean, what we've said. I mean, obviously they haven't mentioned anything about what their overhaul should be. But what we think the, he the, needs. The first thing that came to mind for me is he should be faster. Yeah, for, his walk speed should be so much faster than what it is. He's so. He, 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 he's, I, I, I know that's a style that he can't let relax, he kind of meanders, but he should at least just move a bit quicker. I mean, it's yeah. It's like it's like grappler speed. Yeah, it, feel, it feels like it. Yeah, it's, it's almost better than Makoto. <laughs> yeah, I say, and obviously, but then Makoto has the dash. dash. Yeah. Um, oh, and we we think he needs a better poke. Yeah, like he's got a decent standing hard kick, but it's quite high, so it misses all characters like and quite slow as well. Yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna look at Bison. His standing hard kick and Adon's. I mean, that, I mean, those pokes are ridiculously good. I mean, just think, Cody, to compete, he needs he needs a better poke. It, Cody's standing medium kick is beyond bad. I hate the look of it. It never gets used. So yeah, just better po pose and better priority. No, I think posts. I think he only needs one pose. Obviously, I know he's meant to get in close and frame trap you, which will, yeah. which will come to our, onto our next point. But I think he just needs just to kind of just poke and then go in. You know, kind of mix it up. But without a poke, he's, he hasn't got any range game. And bad stone is pretty bad, as as the name implies. All right, so now onto the nerfs. Um, less frame traps. Yeah, less. Or frame just frame. well, no, less not viable. Yeah, because. It, um, if you get a Riga Cody, I mean, you can't it. Yeah. Um, but then that's pretty much it we put for a nerf Cody, because I said if it's a major overhaul, he might not get any nerfs. Yeah, it'll be like my minute ones. The ones that only the major Cody players would like understand why they're being, like, being used. Okay. Top 8 characters for Ultra Battle 4. We are calling it now. Yeah, th this is what we think Top 8 is going to be. In now. reverse? Oh, yeah, let's go reverse. Oh, yeah, because there's one character that we haven't talked about, but we think, okay. because of the people who are now working at Capcom, they understand the need for a totally new character and also a fan kind of base character to be tournament viable therefore in the top eight. So now, we've put just before yeah. they said that it's a character Oh yes, yeah, yeah. who's never been in a fighting game before, yeah. but is strongly linked to Street Fighter. So we thought Kutetsu. Yes. Who, if you don't know, was the uh, teacher of Gukin and Akuma and Mas has the master. Uh, the sensei. And had been mentioned a few times in the Street Fighter on law. Yeah, and among long fans, I think that'd be pretty cool because I know loads of people want Hagar. I'm not really bothered. I'm not Hagar. bothered. And also, you've got Hugo. Do you really need another grappler? Yeah, Hugo, Geef, T Hawk, Hagar. Anyway, and Fuerte if you can as well. But anyway, yeah. yeah. So that's what we're calling that out right now. We think it's going to be Kutetsu. And I would kind of like that as long as he wasn't as broken as a Kuma. And I was quite in there. I'm a bit gutted that all of the new characters, none of them are charged. Anyway. Yeah. Okay, so. Bottom of the top eight, we think it will be the new character. Whoever yeah. it is, we think they'll just just be in top eight. Because as we've said, we think they'll want to see them in tournaments, and for that yeah. reason, they've got to be usable. Okay. Then we think it's going to be Rufus. Rufus. We think he'll he's, he'll, he'll, he'll still be there. He's like a Kuma. He's always going to be there. Even even when Zagat in like Vanilla Four was clearly best, the Kuma and Rufus were up there. Yeah, exactly. After that, Rolento. And another new character that we haven't mentioned. The reason we haven't, we haven't mentioned him is because we think whatever he gets, he'll be he'll be top eight. He's going to be like a better version of Cody, frame cuts for the win. Yeah, yeah. And then and then he's got good spacing moves. His standing medium kick and cross second anyway was ridiculous. Vega mix with Cody. He's also got the rollback, so you think he, he, he can bake things out. Yeah. So we think Relento is going to be top eight with that with that now. Then jury. So yeah, as we said, we think she's she's, she's, she's going to be in there. Then Yun. Yeah, fortunately. And we think he'll get buffed because he was nerfed. Cammy, still, even with the nerfs, Cammy. Oh, yeah, just because the, way, still... just cause the way she plays. Yeah, and she'll probably, and she'll, she'll probably get some buffs. And then oh, she already has them. Her um, thing about her. Yeah, cannon Spike does, it hits lower to the ground. Yeah, so that's already a mix of, uh, a better mix of yeah, her. Is it Cannon Spike or. You know what I mean? Cannon right? Drill. No, Cannon, cannon Drill. drill. Yeah. Cannon Drill. Okay, um, and then the top two, Zet and Akuma. We think that's not going to change. We think whatever they do to balance it, I know we put Jury in there, we put a new one, we put Rolento in. We don't think it's going to change the game enough to change that. No. I know people think that like, I'm hating on the Kuma, which I fellas do, but I'm just saying because of the way he's got so many options, it can't be bad. No, I mean, he, unless, he, unless, you did, unless he did like the lowest damage output and had even less health. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so that's that's our, that's our top hit, and that's what we think will be top in the ultra. Now, obviously, things things are going to change. I'm sure there'll be a surprise. I mean, you know, a Makoto might become like like ridiculous. She just meant to be getting some good buffs. I would quickly say, and also what we've noticed with all the top eight yet again, all rush down. Yeah, and not an all motion. Yawn. But yeah, that's it. I mean, that's what the tournaments are going to be. It's going to be rush yeah. down. This is the era of dive kick. 
So that was the um, the balance changes for Ultra Street Fighter 4 that we think. Yeah, hope in. you like it. Yeah, and please you, leave in the comments yeah. below and tell us what your main character is going to get or you think we'll receive. I'm sure you disagree with us. And tell us your top eight. Yeah. Yeah. Get on with it.